104. Welcome back to Angels of Death. Okay. So Don't be startled. You know why? Because we are one and the same in our desires. That's how you feel. Turn on the light. Small note. Hmm. I shall grant what you desire, but I've got my own desires as well. If possible, I want you to devote yourself to me. I mean, isn't it great being in love? Uh, this guy has the wrong idea. Also, I just got new headphones. So, to me, <laughs> my voice sounds so muffled. <laughs> I know all about you. You want to die, right? It's a thought. Right, so just say yes? Huh. Shoot, how long do I got to stay in the water for? It feels like something rang under my feet. That means I can move now, right? I wonder how she's doing. Guess I'll hop back to the hole she went in. Ah. Huh? What the? Looks like some idiot forgot to pay the electric bill. Place is garbage. She's still not back. Huh. It's in there. That person bolts on me. Eh. That won't happen. What's with her anyway? Won't run and all emotionless. Yeah, killing her would be boring.
Hmm. Apart from my dead-eyed stare, she almost looked alive back there. <sighs> I'm about to go out of my mind. Not again. My character's the one with the torch. Oh. Are you freaking serious? It's pitch black. Who's there? You grave desecrator. That's fair. That's very fair. Huh? Howdy, Zach. It's me, your friend, Flowey the Flower. <laughs> oh, Eddie. I had a nice spot for you with everyone else. But you ruined your own grin. You're insane. Okay, so he's on the cover for the chapter selection. I think, uh, we're getting close to the end. That may be, but don't you think mine was, uh, poor excuse for a break? No? Sorry. Sorry. Due to the circumstances, yours was, a. Uh, Bit of a rush job. The hole's only half tuck. But your tombstone's just fine. Fits you to a T. You catch my drift. How about I make your grave first? Well. <laughs> Enough about you. I'm more interested in getting that girl's grave finished. I'm I'm in love. It's always the same thing. Make graves for murder victims day in and day out. I was getting a touch poor. Sure, making graves is my passion, but the bodies that occupy them are not quite as lovable. Beauty is what they lack. I guess you only make gravestones. I guess you're you're missing uh you're missing the staff to for the beautification process or whatever. Uh, uh undertakers do. But for that girl, I want nothing more than make the grave of my dreams for her. But if you kill her, if you kill her, like, you'll mess up her body, and then you'll, she'll just end up being like the other bodies. So don't kill me, please. <laughs> I think we're around the same age, too. Most of all, I want to show her I understand her. We were made for each other. That should be infinitely more beautiful than some sloppy and mangled corpse. That's how you feel. <laughs> oh, don't do that. That does look right. Oh, should she desire it, sloppy is perfectly fine too. I'm not fine with that. I'm not her, but I'm playing as her. Are you trying to make me What? My sophistication makes me the perfect match for her. Too bad I can't say the same for you. That's why the one taking her life will be me. Sounds like some little punk doesn't know his place. Ugh. 
Just a, <laughs> a, a, a special mention to Humaniki. You know that room that's completely dark? What I did for Humaniki is I just turned up uh, the brightness on my screen so bright that I could actually see what I was doing. <laughs> so I kind of cheated on that. <laughs> Darn him. Hey, get your butt back here. It's cool. Come on open. Yeah. Get something to open the door. There he goes again. Oh, hey, hey, that's not, that's not, that's not friendly. Is it running low on juice? Hey, Rachel. I'll grant your desire. I mean... Wait. For this character... Because... She is the way she is. Is every game over... Really a game over? At least from her perspective. I mean, from my perspective. It's a game over because... I don't want her to die. What was that? Set display the water temperature. Temperature is quite low. Now I feel a tad guilty for making Zach get in the water. Where is the water temperature? Okay. <laughs> Rachel, no. Huh? Lights. No, not so surprised. I was just being kind and courteous to the waters of this place. The one who's talking to you this whole time is none other than me. There's no need to run. I won't fly off the handle and kill you like the others. I mean, I'm gonna kill you, but I'll kill you when you want to be killed. Is that the answer? Besides, I know what you desire. My desire. Yes, that's right. No worries. I know everything about you. Your father and mother. Those close to you. Everything. If it were me, I'd take your life as painlessly as possible, even make the perfect grave for you. But it is you. Plus, just look at me. You and I are even around the same age. We're practically made for each other. I really can't tell your age from your face. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, I can't tell your age at all. Uh, I... 
What are you so silent for? Please, Rachel. Rachel. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> uh. Please say yes. I don't. I have no obligation to say yes. I have no obligation to say yes. I can say no. Hey, get back out here. Uh, it's my friendly neighborhood, Zach. Shoot, can she not hear me? How far did she go? Ah, uh, that grave digging jerk. Thank you, he can outwit me. Yes, he can. You went on a rampage destroying graves just because he had nothing to do, basically. <laughs> that punk. He's in love with her and wants to kill her himself. Thought makes me want to puke. Can't have her go dying on me yet. She mentioned something about another room in the back on the right. Wasn't there a crumbling wall in the dark room on the right side? You guys will take a look. Ooh. Ah, golly! Uh, that just shows you right there how good I am at this game. I can't even run properly. <laughs> I'm not even being chased. There's a crack in the wall. It's a uh, right here. Oh, there it is. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Rachel, what's troubling you? Go on. Tell me your desire. My desire is ellipses. Bring me all the ellipses. I want to die. Look, I told you so. Er, Rachel, let me put you out of your misery. So, will you say yes? Will you marry me? I'm getting impatient. Hey, you said you won't chase after me or anything, so I can be as slow as I want. <laughs> Could it be his doing? Yeah, we got a good love triangle set up right here. Just, just join in on the fun. <laughs> Nuts. Tell me, why are you with Zach? I promise to let him kill me. I mean, I already made a promise with him. It's, it's plain and simple. I promised that he could kill me, so I can't have you kill me. Or I'll be breaking my promise, and that wouldn't be nice. What? That's so messed up! I even offered to kill you myself, too. But if I let you, then he won't be able to get out of here. Because he's a dumb dumb. Is that all? Shouldn't be a problem at all. Oh, so you're gonna let him go until the next floor, right? Because you're a cool guy like that. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Ugh, looks like loudmouths here. Choose who will be your killer. Him or me. Hey, is the game actually giving me a choice? Uh, I'll, I'll want, I don't like those choices. Uh, I don't need those choices. My sweet Rachel, let me lovingly put you to rest. Is 
<laughs> ah, sophisticated. More like medicated. You can kill her with that boring look on her face. What an idiot. I don't know if he has a fair point or if he's just crazy. I'm guessing he's crazy. Oh, will you shut up? Rachel and I are talking. Well, actually, I'm mainly talking, and she's listening, but, you know, that's besides the point. <laughs> hey, can you hear me? I'm not talking to the grave dickin' person. I'm talking to you. Me? Yes, you. Listen up. Don't think for one second that you can die of your own will. There's plenty of people in this building who love to kill you. But all have the honor. I swear. To God. To God? Uh-huh. So make sure no one else gets to you first. So what, is that the first time someone's actually called me Ray? Chill. Where'd that punk go? Why, Rachel? Is it so wrong for me wanting to kill you? Apparently so. <laughs> Of course it's wrong, you moron. Of course it's wrong. Of course you can't kill her. I have to kill her. My, you are so vicious. Rachel, you want him to kill you? He'll definitely buggle it up. Why not let me instead? I'll do a pristine job. <laughs> uh, that's... Shut up, show yourself so I can tear you apart. Rachel, you are mine to kill. So you are gonna chase me. Can you wait for me till then? I bolted on me. You're just as much of a spineless whip yourself. You'll be dead before I even have a chance to kill you. Yeah. Huh? Like I said before, you gotta die, then at least make yourself useful first. If I do, then you'll kill me, right? That's why I've been saying what you said earlier. God. You said God. Uh, why is that such an important point? Yeah, to God. Um, you said that you swear to God. 
Uh, Rachel, you're you're probably scaring him. Is what you said true? You'll swear to God for me. You swear to God you'll kill me? That doesn't seem like a. Uh, For goodness sake, yes, now quit pestering me. I hate liars. I see. Gotcha. I'll do everything I can. <laughs> to make myself useful to you. Then we're good. So, what's the plan now? I heard the sound of a door open earlier. I think it might be the door below here. That kid is waiting, or so he said. This. I picked this up here. I busted it up real good earlier. This really came in handy. Should have made more use of it earlier. I had no idea you had so much destructive power. Huh? Funny enough, it still smells like dirt here. Oh, world more graves? Hey, don't get any ideas about going into any more holes. Said I wouldn't kill myself. Huh. Suppose he did. Anyway, I have no intention of sticking around this dirt dump. Let's get out of here. Oh, wait. Hey, what's your name again? Just open up your inventory menu and you'll see my name. Rachel Gardner. Oh. I'm taking you along for my own personal gain. Yeah, that's clear. But man, it's a pain having you around. Right, Ray? Hello, we meet again. Out of my way. Oh, are we gonna have ourselves a boss battle? What makes you think I gotta do what you say? Hey Rachel, are you sure you don't want me to do it? Do you even know anything about who this guy is? Uh, vaguely. I vaguely know who this guy is. He has no passion for grace and a slovenly past. I read about his past on a document earlier. And what's the problem? I choose him over me. I can kill you too, you know. <laughs> uh, he's, he swore to God they'd kill me. Uh, Rachel, that's not a selling point. That's not a selling point. That alone is everything to me. Who's this high and mighty god? That's crazy. 
so-called god of yours never told me any of this. No such freedom exists in this place. The only freedom we're given is for our actions on our own floors. And the right to kill. Uh, but that just like bailed on his floor and followed me. <laughs> so, I mean, you know, if you want to come with, I'd be alright with that. You can come with us. You're not the one who will kill me. You hear that? How you like that? Oh, how dreadful. Just wanted to bury you, preserving your beauty. No. Uh. If you wanna be. That's not gonna preserve anything. <laughs> Don't you know? Grades are dark, cool, and comfy. Have you been in a grave before? At the very least, let me take you there. Wait. How about a compromise? Zack gets to kill me, and you get to bury my body. So, even Steven? Question mark? <laughs> no! You worthless. Elion? Shut up. It's not like you're any different from me. Just another murderer. Speak for yourself. For all your physical strength, you still haven't been able to catch anyone with that empty head of yours. What? 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 <laughs> oh. oh, so everyone at least made it past his floor? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Zach. I'm sorry, that's kind of sad. Unable to kill anyone. Just a useless angry mess. That's rich coming from you. You're the one who's desperate. Just a frustrated little person who can't kill a fly is all you're on. Psh, give me a break. Shut your trap, you idiot. Okay, so... From that, that means most, if not all, people... <laughs> probably make it past they make it past Zack they probably make it past the doctor and they likely uh, make it past him either that or they give up at this point maybe that's what the gravestones are people who just like gave up or just like to make it gravestones just I build a ton of gravestones no dead bodies just a ton of gravestones huh As far as I'm concerned, you don't exist. I mean, you're Rachel, not you. Even though it's part of your job to actually take him out as well, since he did uh, break the rules of this place. <laughs> Rachel, I'll seal you eternally in a lovely casket of stone. Oh no, 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 no! Ah, it's the boss battle gonna be in the dark! No! Oh. Oh. Let me turn my mic down. I blew out my mic. I can tell from it turning red, I blew out my mic. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Where are you?
I'm dead. I'm dead. I died. <laughs> Found you, Rachel. Found you, Rachel. <laughs> uh, yeah, game over. Okay. Okay. So bad. I did so much worse. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that didn't sound elegant. Why, Rachel, why? I even made a grave for you and everything. I will admit, the grave looked nice. I'll be fair, in that regard. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, no. Can't you take a hint? She jumped you. <laughs> <laughs> Trey doesn't want your petty grave. Get away, traitor. Grave is resonator. Rachel! Lose this fiendish ruffian and hop into my grave. What do you say? Hey, you're so aggressive, How shall I carry you first? <laughs> I got the perfect one picked out for you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'll seal it up tight, just like you said. That's that. I guess I'll go down and talk to you. This actually was a hard maze, the stress of trying to get around. Hey, not bad for a punk kid. That guy's six feet under, just like he won. Yeah. <sighs> Something's on the back of his grave. Huh. <coughs> Excuse me? There's a set that says elevator gate. It's probably the elevator switch. 
I can say goodbye to this dark breaking dump. This is B4. So there's probably still more floors above. Uh, then we'll let in. Um. myself useless to you, sir. Er, you can quite call me sir. Makes me edgy. How about Isaac? Zach? Call me Zach. Okay. Was I of any use to you, Zach? Just a tiny bit. Oh. My character's kind of weird. Let's get going. Okay. Ah, that's the end of episode one. That's right. To be continued in episode 2. So this was the end of episode 1. There's 4 episodes. <laughs> Took me 40 minutes to finish this. Uh, but... Yeah. Uh, so far this game's interesting. <laughs> So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.